What is heat affected zone has in welding? Welding is a popular and essential process used in several industries to join two or more metal components. However, welding can create a heat affected zone has which can affect the mechanical properties of the welded joint. Understanding has is crucial in welding to ensure the quality and durability of the welded joint. In this article, we will discuss what is has in welding, its formation, and the factors that affect it. What is heat affected zone has in welding? Heat affected zone has is the area surrounding the welded joint that is subjected to a significant amount of heat during the welding process. The temperature in this zone is high enough to cause changes in the microstructure of the metal, affecting its mechanical properties. The size of the has depends on several factors, including the welding process, welding parameters, base metal composition, and thickness. Formation of has. The formation of has occurs due to the heat generated by the welding process. The heat is concentrated in a small area around the welding arc, which causes the temperature in the region to rise above the critical transformation temperature. The critical temperature is the temperature at which the metal's microstructure starts to change. When the metal's temperature exceeds the critical temperature, it undergoes several changes, including recrystallization, grain growth, and phase transformations. These changes can result in a loss of strength, ductility, and toughness in the has. Factors affecting has. Several factors can affect the size and properties of the has. These include welding process. Different welding processes generate different amounts of heat, which can affect the size of the has. For example, the heat generated by gas welding is lower than that generated by arc welding. Welding parameters. Welding parameters, such as welding speed, heat input, and welding current, can significantly affect the size and properties of the has. A higher heat input and welding current can result in a larger has. Base metal composition. The composition of the base metal can also affect the has. Materials with higher carbon content or alloying elements are more susceptible to has cracking and reduce toughness. Base metal thickness. The thickness of the base metal can also affect the size of the has. A thicker base metal will require more heat input, resulting in a larger has. Conclusion. In conclusion, the heat affected zone, has, is an essential aspect of welding that can significantly affect the mechanical properties of the welded joint. Understanding the factors that affect the size and properties of the has is crucial in producing high quality and durable welded joints. Welders must take the necessary precautions to minimize the size of the has and ensure that the welded joint has the desired mechanical properties.